Bigger grocery bills. The rise in food prices is causing a local food bank to see a rise in demand. Taylor Toshev reports. Pennsylvanians aren't the only ones concerned about higher prices. The Central Pennsylvania Food Bank is too. We're certainly worried about household inflation. You know, folks are really, they're really worried. Uh, some folks who are, you know, kind of right on the line or not yet, you know, uh, pinched on their budget are now um, needing help to afford their food. The food bank says it was starting to see a slight improvement after two years of the pandemic. But as we got into February and now into March, we are seeing hundreds more people coming for help. Not only that, but impacts are being felt when it comes to food bank operations. We're seeing higher prices in the truckloads of food that we buy, but also we have diesel trucks. We have 26 of them every single day out there using fuel. Last week, the government reported consumer prices were up 7.9% in February from a year earlier. That's the sharpest spike since 1982. But if you go to the grocery store, you're looking at meat, poultry, fish, eggs that have gone up over 12%. So it's very significant. And it could be a while until grocery bills are down. Plan for higher prices. They're probably going to be here longer than you expect. More until then, so Jim Degatano, president of Diamond Wealth Advisors, has some advice. Their, their Look at your budget and see where those pressures are coming from. Grocery store, dining out. Uh, we want people to go out and, and, and spend their money. That's that's a good thing for the economy. Uh, but I think you'll also see consumers start looking at more discounted stores. Taylor Toshef, ABC 27 News.